the all love work is the heart opening experience. It's like to learn to love more than you ever have before and love in a way that is not needing of anyone else or anything else, but to love without need. That to me is what real love is. Uh, if you ever have attended a class with Patrick, which I know you have, it's a little bit more of a rip snorter than the ones that I hold. It comes through me a bit more gently. But what I've watched in the all love classes and the mastery that Patrick has is uh, jaw dropping. You know, I've seen a person be furious about someone's interaction with them. And he can walk them through the story that they have and they come to a point where they suddenly recognize if this hadn't happened, I wouldn't have this ability. They, they can find in the painful experience the gift that was waiting for them to see, the, the, the strength of character that they've developed because of it. And the, what I watched happen was someone who believed that this person was a complete villain and suddenly they felt gratitude. That was jaw-dropping. <laughs> and that's the kind of thing that can happen in these classes, where if you go into the pain that you've experienced and really look at what you received out of it, what, what did you benefit? All of a sudden, you can recognize a mastery that you achieved through walking through that pain. I'm not saying that you should stay in a painful experience. <laughs> Or that you shouldn't feel bad about it. I don't, I, I'm somebody who believes in embracing all of the feelings that you have. But I have watched it happen where it's like an about face in how people experience that event in their life, a past event. And that about face releases it from their body. Then they are free of it. I also remember being in Puerto Rico and Patrick's class, and we had a class of half African American from New Jersey, uh, half Hispanic, and a few of us light-faced people in there. And this, they, one of the folks was talking about the anger about slavery. Dear Patrick likes to use a pointy stick. It's like taking that stick and stabbing you with the exact thing you are upset about. He was in the middle of the room with the guy that had brought up slavery, this close to him, and the guy was screaming at him. And all Patrick did was go deeper. And the guy went into his pain. And it turned out I was driving this guy home <laughs> that night, and I'm going, oh no, oh no. And from the back of the car, I hear Sherry, and I went, oh, here it comes. And from the back seat, I heard, never in my life would I have believed a white man would have helped me with my issues about slavery. Mm. And that was amazing. It was just heart opening to hear him share that. It's a somewhat unbelievable uh, experience. And I'm really, really, really grateful that I have had the, the chance to work so deeply with Patrick and, and to share it. I, I am constantly, it's, 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 it makes my life sing to be able to share the all love energy.